you won't believe this, but I just murdered a group that looked exactly like you. Weird. First question. How much of a chicken's egg weight is because of the shell? Use your device to answer the question. Oh. And the correct answer is... Who got the question right? <laughs> Everyone is wrong. Time for consequences. Welcome to room 101. A game of telephone. I'm giving each of you a telephone, but I only have two phone numbers. Dial one of these numbers on your rotary phone before anyone else or you die. I'll have you know, I had to kill a lot of hipsters to get these rotary phones. Get busy living, or get busy signal dying. Yeah, you know what? That one, that one looks better on paper. <laughs> Let's try another one. Mother always showed me love by holding it just out of my reach. Which of the following is not one of the five love languages, according to author Gary Chapman? <laughs> Who picked this? <laughs> Everyone is wrong. Come with me. Screw it. Let's play a game of Quiplash. Hey, it's exhausting coming up with these minigame ideas. The game will send a question to your devices. Enter the best answer you can think of and hit send. I made this time longer than usual. All right, without further ado. There's nothing better to drink before bed than a nice, warm glass of blank. Now your friend will vote for the answer they like best. The player that gets the fewest votes. Let's see the votes. Losing happened. Let's keep moving. Which of these is not a Latin phrase? <laughs> Who picked this? Lucky guesses. Let's try another one. Time for a question about classic cinema. What team did Michael Jordan play for in the 1996 film Space Jam? Who picked this? Only a ghost got it wrong. I don't like seeing that. Let's keep moving. Which breed of dog is typically the cutest little thing? I mean the smallest. Who picked this? Everyone again? You all need to be taught a lesson. It's my old favorite, chalices. I've given each safe player a poison pellet. Pick a chalice to drop your poison in.
Now it's your turn to play. Pick a chop. Mmm. Now let's see what you drank. You poisoned. Ah, crap. You all died too early. Bummer. Whoa, that was crazy. I guess the universe really wants you to get to the final round because it undid that last horrible mistake. Don't squander this second chance. It's time for the next question. What's a cicada called when it first emerges from its larval state underground? Who picked this? Well, that sucks. Let's try another one. Which of these Shakespeare plays does not have a ghost in it? Who picked this? One of you is still alive. I want to show you something. Let's see if the safe players are good at forgery. Oh, hey, look! The ghost of my Aunt Mildred is writing on this mirror. She has her own consistent handwriting. Now, Aunt Mildred is going to write a different word. But so will all the safe players. Draw a word on the mirror to camouflage Aunt Mildred's. Start writing on that mirror. Watch closely. One of these new words will be a word written by Aunt Mildred's ghost. So many convincing words to choose from. Now, type the word that Aunt Mildred wrote or you die. Would the real Aunt Mildred please stand up? Aww, you got it. Aw man, mirrors are such bad luck for me. We're here! The final round is close. Next question! If you took a black light to this hotel, what would you find a lot of because they glow under UV light? Who picked... this? It's time! Pegs! You're going to drop down this board and try to avoid the death zones. Hmm, someone needs to pick which slots are death zones. Hey you, pick the landing slots that kill. Okay! Let the games begin! It's like you don't know if they're going right or left, but you know they're going down. Well, that was thrilling, but if I'm being 100% honest, I'm a little disappointed. Okay, moving on. Only one of you is still alive. You know what that means. Glad to see you're the one to make it here alive, but will you be the one to escape? Here's your first category. Kentucky Derby winners. Tap each answer that fits the category and then press submit. Let's see the right answers. Charlie Chaplin Films. I don't know if you can outrun those ghosts. Books over a thousand pages.
born in South Africa. Don't look back because there's a ghost right there. Don't look behind you. Here comes the darkness. Lyrics and Billy Joel, we didn't start the fire. Time is almost up. A ghost stole your life force. Bottom row of a QWERTY keyboard. I'm going too easy on you. Here comes the next question. Three syllable words. Wow, I don't know who's gonna win. Vodka brands. So fast, you need a perfect answer for your final escape. And that includes the third answer choice now, too. You have to get all the right answers to escape. Another life force swap. Galaxies. Time is almost up. 